Hi, uh, this is Maria, Maria's Garden in Punta Gorda, Florida. Today, what I'm gonna be doing uh, most of the day, walking around and checking my uh, plant for seapads. This is a seapad, come on little baby, you are not, go there, go there, okay. This is one of the seapads for my big desert rosa. This seapad is ready, okay? So this is ready, when they get this size, about 12 inches, they are ready. So what you do, oh my goodness, this little thing. So you get a little piece of wire, just flexible wire, any type. Usually I go to the secondhand stores and buy crafts and stuff like that. It's cheaper than going to Home Depot and Lowe's. You can wrap them with anything. So you just go like this, like candy cane, okay? Wrap them out like this. You cut two pieces of wire. It's the easy way to do it, okay? Very nice and, um, and the reason we're doing this, because these sipas are very, very unpredictable. These are mature, and what happened, if I don't do this, okay? If I don't do this, I can come tomorrow, and this is open, and all the seeds are gone. They fly away, because they're like feathers, okay? So this is what we do. This is um, how we save them. And, oops. Oops, I have a little extra wire so I can go ahead and start doing this other one. Make sure don't break them, okay? Because they're not dry yet. Oh, what's bothering me? Oops, what kind of mosquitoes? Okay, so you keep going like this to this one, like candy can. I'm just gonna use this wire here, and I already have a piece in here. And this time of the year is when, the, when all the uh, plants produce most of the seed pads. so this is the time that you have to go around and check your plants and uh, make sure the um you um wrap it like candy cane yes like this like this and uh, that's how you're gonna save them but the teenage you have to wait until they're mature so oh my goodness see so a little more over here because they open and I lose so many seeds over the years, you'll be, you'll be surprised. But not anymore because every time I see a little, a little sipa coming out, out, I usually mark the plant. I mark the plant with this uh, little red thing over here. This little mark that I have that I know where my sipas are. And, um, and that way I will go back and keep checking and I know when they are ready. Okay. So he, this is a, this is how it's gonna look, okay? This plant has two, and this one is already wrapped also, you see? This is one, and this is two over here, and I can see a lot of seed pads, a lot of seed coming, all this over here, the seed, seed pads are coming, but they're not ready. So also, over here, and this plant, and this plant over here, um, I mark this plant, because this one has a seed pad, you see this? But it's not big enough. It has to be like least two inches, big, strong, and we can wrap it. We cannot wrap it like this because we'll kill it. Uh, and a lot of plants, when the plants are from seeds, it's um, very, very easy. The, the plant can be just a year old and can produce a seed pad, okay? A lot of my plants, they are some of the plants I have in the back, they are little plants and they already have a seed pad. So today is the day I'm gonna be wrapping up my sipas. Make sure you check your plants and uh, uh, carapillos. I found some carapillos, so just take them out and put them in another plant. Uh, and check your plants for sipas. Thank you. Until next time, please subscribe. If you have any questions, send them to me. If I know the answer, I will, but I don't know everything. Bye-bye.